Scania's clever cruise control uses GPS to read the topography of the road ahead, making the most of every drop of fuel. Cruising economically is much more than just engaging the cruise control. A normal cruise control sticks to the set speed in all conditions. That's comfortable, but has its drawbacks. Some simple tricks will help you save a lot of fuel. Some extra speed when entering a hill will build up turbo pressure, prevent unwanted gear changes and save time. Lift off the accelerator before you start going downhill. You will gain speed down the hill anyway. This is where the most fuel is saved. This is exactly what Scania's active prediction system does with the help of GPS data. The map data is stored in the Scania communicator, which is fitted as standard in many European markets. Use the steering wheel buttons to set the desired cruising speed and the downhill speed of the retarder. At least four to five kilometers an hour is the recommended speed difference. On the display, you will also see the speed interval that active prediction will use. The system permits an overspeed of up to 4% before a climb and a speed reduction of up to 8%. If you cruise at 85 km an hour and set the downhill speed at 89, the working range of active prediction will be between 78 and 86. The system needs a 3 km gap to the downhill setting. As soon as the system adjusts the speed, a green E will appear in the display. You can also get the information in a favorites window, including the green E when the system is adjusting the speed. If the GPS data is lost or unavailable on a certain route, the display will turn gray. The cruise control then functions in the normal way. Field test driver John Lennon in Ireland gives his impressions of Scania Active Prediction after trying it for six months. I've been working with this system now for six months approximately and um, I'm very impressed with the functionality of it and the way it tells you that it's intervening so that you know what is actually happening and why the vehicle is behaving the way it is behaving. It will be doing what you would feel that you should be doing yourself to save fuel. I would definitely want to include this function in the new vehicles. I've experienced it. I'm happy with the way it works. It's so simple and it saves you money. Here are the basic tricks then. Scania Active Prediction increases the speed slightly when entering a hill to make maximum use of the torque of the engine and slows down slightly before going downhill if it predicts that the weight will make the vehicle accelerate by itself up to the set cruising speed. Allowing the system to drive like this will save up to 3% of fuel. You can trust Scania's new cruise control to do it automatically for you.